talked about um, the basics of master pages and what they're used for, essentially the different layouts in InDesign. And I mentioned that I would show you how to apply them quickly to save us time because the method we talked about in that video was click and drag. Um, and that can be useful uh, in a pinch, but if you're doing a very large document, um, clicking and dragging is just not feasible onto you know 50 or 100 pages. So here are some other methods. I have two masters in this document, one called C covers, which is for my front and my back cover, and then one called IN inside pages, which is for the inside pages uh, of this document. So like we said, if I click and hold on the master name and I drag it over a page I want it to apply to, well, if I go to that page, I can see that it has been applied to that one page. Problem is, is that now I have, you know, three more pages to go or in your case maybe you have a hundred more pages to go so we need we need a faster way and here are a couple methods you can use the first one is to highlight uh, let's say the pages you'd like to apply that master to so to highlight the pages over on the pages panel you're gonna click on the page you want to start applying the master to then I'm gonna hold shift and I'm going to click on the page I want to stop applying the master at. So it's just a shift click selection, which you might be familiar with from all, all over in Windows and, uh, and Mac. It's kind of a generic keyboard shortcut. So you can see they've turned a different color blue. They're selected. And what I do now is I actually just hold down the Alt key and click on the master I want to apply. So in this case, I'm going to click on uh, Inside Pages. And you can see that the Inside Pages gets applied to those pages in my document that were selected. That's probably the fastest way you can go about doing it. So you click once on the start page, you hold shift, you click on the end page, and then you would hold down the alt key and click on the master you would want to apply. It's as simple as that. The other way to do this is to use the pages panel. So if you click on the panel options button in the top corner of that panel, you actually have an option that says apply master to pages. You can choose what master you want to apply and then you can specify whatever page range you'd like to apply it to. And the, the page range is done with a dash. You hit OK and it applies it. So those are some other methods for applying master pages because click and drag is probably not going to cut it. So hopefully that helped. If it did, just click the little like button down below. And please watch my other videos because there's lots of good information.